Hey guys, welcome back. This is MD. I'm going to take you through finding the unknown near weapon or the IPCA stun gun. So it's basically a gun that was uh, previously in the Siphon Filter game used by Gabe Logan. Uh, it was an air taser basically. If you played that game, so you probably know it and if you have used it a lot. Uh, uh, you, you will find this uh, weapon like uh, late in the game after the story missions. So O'Brien will call you and you'll unlock this uh this, like this secret unknown weapon basically and the thing is like you need to craft it uh you need to craft it so you need to find materials and everything so i'm gonna like take you through that as well so here we are like i'm showing you like uh this gun is like uh has a hundred percent like charged weight and you can use it uh, unlimitedly unlimitedly on uh, the enemies basically and you can use it on the freakers reapers humans animals and whatever so not only like it, it stuns them, it even like burns them if you like hold the, the what's it called, the, the shot. Uh, you can use it on the birds, but of course uh, the bigger enemies uh, are damaged or like uh, hurt by it, but they can still attack you. So be careful of, uh, of that. Uh, but it is fun. It's evilish. It is, it is so fun to use it. And you can use it on the enemies that are like, uh, you know, they dance basically when you like electrocute them or stun them. But anyway, here we start. Uh, I'm going to show you the, the location that we will get the RPCA techs. We need 18 of them uh, to craft this uh, weapon. So basically, you will find them in the narrow sites or the narrow research site. And when we go here, we are like basically looking uh, for uh, guys wearing the white suits. So basically, when you go to, to these areas, uh, you'll you actually see on the map, you'll see an X where there's a dead body. So you will be, they'll be like hard to miss as well. So you go to them and you like search them and you get the IPCA tech. And like I said, we need 18 of them. And you cannot like miss them. They're, sometimes they are like far away from the station, but mostly they are like uh, very, very close by. And when you see the X, so you will know where they are. Sometimes they are in the, the like the, what's it called? Uh, the trucks where the narrow trucks or the, the caravans. So yeah. The, just just go around, search around, and you'll find it. But I'm gonna show you show it to you anyway. So here we are, uh, the second area here. We will find him. They are always ripped in pieces, by the way, chopped in half. Just go to them, search them. Uh, and now the uh, the third one, which is the old pioneer cemetery. Uh, I'm taking you to, like through each area. Like I'm just gonna finish the first area first, then I'm gonna go to the second, then the third. I don't want you just going up and down, up and down. But yeah, uh, the, we need 18. That's a lot. So bear with me on that one, and I'll try to like show you exactly where they are. Try to make it convenient. Uh, and, but uh, like I said, uh, if you already gone to these areas like before, so you already have half of them at least, maybe something like that. But anyway, just just just, just go uh, to these areas like once more and and check for yourself. This is one of the first uh, areas, the little beer uh, lake. This is the first areas that you're gonna come here and find the the syringe for the what's called the nearest syringe. So. Probably you have already taken it, but you, as I said, you can sometimes find the body inside. But usually, usually it's far away uh, from these like checkpoints, so you need to like find that X on the. And sometimes you will find the uh, yellow wearing guys. Yellow wearing guys, they will give you the med kits. It's the white dudes or the white wearing dudes that we're trying to find. The fifth one, the neuro research site in the Cascade region, the first region basically, uh, is just below the Copeland's. Uh, uh, what's it called the uh, camp uh, just come here I think we need the nitros uh, for this one okay we need the nitros so if you, there is a mission where you're like asked to give something to Tucker or to Copeland just go with Copeland because Tucker is basically useless in my opinion so just uh, go with Copeland and you will be able to raise the trust and you will get the nitros early on in the game because we need it we need it for some of these uh, areas and it's fun nitros is always fun but anyway so yeah here we are on our sixth IPC tech uh, we need the nitros here as well. Uh, these two areas where, the, where we need the nitros, is, is, the body is usually very close by to that uh, crash site. So it's very hard uh, to miss actually. But yeah, you look here, you don't have to like go far. I mean, sometimes it's far, but it's not that, that far. So just don't wander around like uh, all, all the way to the end. So if you can't find it uh, by yourself, so it may probably mean that you already took it, of course. But yeah, it's, it's very, very close and you will find that uh, X and it's some, somewhat like the same body or like ripped in half or like uh, they had a terrible death. But anyway, so the seventh uh, IPC attack is in the Iron Butte Pass uh, near a checkpoint. Most of these checkpoints are, are near the tunnels and on your way. So uh, like I said, they are very, very hard to miss. 
but uh, I had the pro trouble because like I picked up some of them early in the game and I was like having trouble uh, to find the rest of them because I didn't know like what I'm searching for basically so and I didn't know how to get them so I had like trouble so I had to go to uh, all of these areas once more to see what I was missing and what I was not and uh, it was like a bit tough because I tried to like I wanted to find the bodies again to show it to you guys like where they are exactly but yeah but if you don't if you can't find it there if you can't find that X then just just get out because you have already uh, taken it and this area here it uh, the map might be a little bit of uh, I mean a little bit different from uh, what you're seeing here because uh, I don't want to spoil anything but yes things happen so don't worry if it's like different from, from your map but just just come to this area come to this uh, site and of course we need the nitros for it and you will find the body uh, here uh, and it, just take the IPC out. I don't know why they made it 18 they could have just made it 10 or something like that you they could have made it like fun uh, but yeah uh, what can we do now uh, the lost lake region this is the second region now we are going for the 10th uh, IPCA tech this is a research side so it does not mean it's gonna be a checkpoint only so it can be a narrow research side and it can be a narrow uh, checkpoint and by now your writers should be like better I think you're gonna have like this the second level or third level so you should be you should be uh, good because we will be using the the nitros quite a lot uh, for for these uh, uh, what's it called uh, text to find these texts to get to these areas ripped in half and this is this is here the 11th uh, this is the old sawmill uh, you will you will come here differently because there's a hole that you need to clear at the end of the game uh, and this is this is my what like one of my favorite areas to be honest when you're playing the game you will know because uh, I'm gonna make a review about this game so you'll know I'm, I'm gonna give you my points and everything but yeah this guy's here uh, at the end of the like uh, the camp or the, uh, uh, the sawmill and it's, he's in the water basically the waterfall so you just gonna find him there and this nearer uh, side um, uh, uh, by the way be careful because you will you'll see that there's a, a nest uh, and for this near side if you like uh, here just uh, burn this nest to get the fuse the fuse is inside that nest and the guy we're looking for is on the left side of the tunnel just go through this uh, uh, area and you will find him there laying around the volcanic legacy uh, this is the third area as well and these things are like very 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 like hard to miss I mean you will find them definitely but this this guy here because you will see the X on the map on the top so you'll go there you're like where the hell is the body you can't find the body but actually the body is underneath inside the tunnel so just get down go under I mean underneath the what's it called the tunnel you'll find another like a cave or something just get inside just jump around and you will uh, find the guy uh, laying around. I think maybe he was like trying to run away from this monster, but he was uh, caught and ripped into pieces. <laughs> Why am I laughing on these things? Uh, anyway, here, here, number fourteen. Uh, when you come to this area, you will find a lot. I think a horde and like an, uh, and a lot of like freakers in this area. Just go to these like uh, two garage-looking things. Uh, just get inside, and you will find the guy inside. Uh, the last one in the corner. That's where we will find the guy, basically. Number. Uh, 15 uh, this is uh, a small island near the uh, one of the camps and you need to have the uh, what's it called a good night was at the level 2 at least so you can like jump to the other side because you don't want to drop in the water and die uh, I don't know why they made it uh, like that why why would you die if you, I mean you should be able to swim but anyway uh, it's, it's, some, it's not something that we should have talked about but anyway the guys here it's immediately as soon as you jump in and you'll find them basically and then just just uh, jump out this is one of the few guys who is still in, in peace. Number 16. This guy. We need to like jump twice uh, for this one here. Uh, it's back in the southeast uh, corner. Uh, there's also an ambush camp nearby. A camp nearby and uh, there's also a flower uh, which has the skull mark on it in, the, in that camp. So just, just check around this area as well. Uh, clear everything so you don't have to like come back again. But yeah, here we need to get all the way to the end, and here we are near the crash site, and you will find him, and you will find the syringe in that white box as well. 
17 and just going until the end of the the tunnel just uh, the tunnel I think is closed so just get on the tunnel like over the, the tunnel and just keep walking and you will find him actually at the top so just come all the way to the end just from here just go all the way and you will find him just before the the rail tracks just over there now not last but not the least this is also an ambush camp as well and there's a narrow search uh, site as well the bunker is uh, in the one of the uh, tents which is uh, near the road uh, and the guy we are like, looking for he's all the way up on the top so just go all the way to the top and you will find him this is the last guy and as soon as we get him now you have all 18 of the techs uh, just uh, open your uh, what's it called uh, menu it's uh, gonna be near the pistol and just just craft it and as you can see it's very very fun to kill people just just fun don't try it on hordes by the way they will like mess you up the hordes the bears it does not work it's fun but if it's there alone but you'll not get the chance but anyway guys uh, that's it yeah uh, thanks for likes and uh, comments and watching our videos subscribe to, subscribing to our channel as well and you guys are awesome and stay awesome guys